Taylor, um, Eternal 50, professional debut, you've got to be happy with the result. Oh yeah, nah, super stoked with that, eh? Um, yeah, awesome just about to get out there and, and finally take that step and uh, just have it behind me now. Yeah, yeah, I've had a, a bit of it. It's like a, a weight lifted, to be honest. At the end, after I was talking to some of the boys and at the end of it, it was like talking about how sometimes it's 80% relief that it's done, you know, and 20% pleasure that you got the win, but it's more everything that you've made it through the fight camp, you made it to the fight, you got it done. Um, yeah, no, I was super stoked there and it was, um, yeah, no, it was really cool to get it done there with my, my family there and, um, and all my friends and, you know, everyone that's close to me. So, yeah, no, it was really good. Good, good to see the uh, Whangarei uh, crowd come down to support you. Yeah, no, nah, it was awesome. I actually didn't realise a lot of them were coming until that afternoon. They turned up to my house and uh, surprised me, so that was cool. You know, it gave me a bit of energy and, um, no, nah, yeah, it was really cool. And then my brothers after it, they came out and, and you know, I didn't realise they were going to do one, but they ended up doing a haka and I had to respond. You know, so uh, ah, a bit of, bit of something to give the crowd, I suppose. No, nah, but it was more, it wasn't really anything to do with that. It was just um, respect to my brothers and my, fa and my whanau, you know, and, um, you know, it was, um, it was really cool, so, yeah. I, I know it's um, been, you, you've thought it's taken a long time, but all those uh, amateur fights and the competitions, the overseas competition, all stood by you. Yeah, no, definitely. Um, when I went in there, obviously you have a bit of nerves and you have all that stuff, doesn't matter who you're fighting, you know. Um, but I went in there with a lot of confidence in what I've already been through and what I've already learned, my experience that I've, I've, I've had. So, um, yeah, I, often it was quite funny. I was talking to my, one of my mates just before the fight. I was saying to him, I want to get a head kick knockout because I don't have any, anything in my hands, you know. And then my first punch, my first punch drops him. And it kind of like, you know, a little, little bit of realisation of, um, you know, when you're consistent and you're putting in the time in the gym and you're like, you know, you can trust, you can trust your, your abilities and you can throw everything with it, you know, and not be afraid, oh no, I'm going to gas out, you know, because you've already put in the work. So that's why I felt this, this fight. I have really felt it, all the confidence just to throw everything into it, you know, and, um, and it turned out really well, yeah. Did you think after that right hand that it was going to be all over in a, in a matter of seconds? I actually didn't think he was going to get up, to be honest. I, when I hit him, I, you see me, I look like a little bit like a flattering, flattering, flattering fish there, right? Eh? Like, I'm just like throwing my arms around. I'm expecting just a couple of hit and him just to stay down. But he's a real tough guy, James. You know, James, I've got a lot of respect for that guy. And, um, he just kept going up, kept getting up. I, I was riding his, his hips there and just throwing, throwing left hook pins on him. It didn't, didn't matter too much. Eh? He just kept getting up. So. Yeah, no, I'm, I was happy though, you know, I was really happy to be able to incorporate both sides of the game there. You know, be able to drop him and then with my hands and then, um, you know, get a bit of control with the wrestling and then be able to finish off with a bit of jits at the end. It felt really good, you know, it felt good to be able to get all the bits in there and um, feel comfortable with it, so, yeah. Any idea when the next time we'll get to see you in action? Not too sure yet. I'm, yeah, I'm really keen to get in real soon. I don't want to let my uh, rest period last too long or else I'll start binging out on things I shouldn't and um, yeah too much pizza lately but um, yeah no hopefully really soon I'm gonna let, um, hopefully have a chat to you soon uh, I haven't talked to him too much yet obviously he's got a lot on his plate with Izzy fighting next weekend uh, so we'll wait for that all to calm down and um, have a good chat hopefully something can line up real quick and get in there yeah yeah, well, you're not the only one that hopes it happens yeah, real yeah. quick either it was good watching you it would be good to see you again yeah no for sure yeah thank you Thank you very much. Yeah, pretty. It feels, feels natural talking to Tony these days, eh? Some people come along. Yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. I feel terrible, guys. I've been eating so much and then just back in the training. It's just like not doing anything.